Me and my niggas, we ain't never going wrong. And you have to do it all just to know where it gets you. Living dreams we can never... What's it? What's up? What's good? How y'all been? Okay, so this is a story time. And a little bit of, like, an update, I guess. So, first update. I just got a Snapchat from David. No, just... Alright, that's not my first update. But for real. First update is this. Yeah, this is not fake, I promise you. I don't, like, do things for attention. I always get hurt. Like, I'm so serious. I always end up getting hurt. Always get... Okay. Okay. So, basically, long story short, I slammed this, I didn't like, basically, my thumb got slammed into a door. And so, yeah, I will probably do a story time on that. Um, but, yeah. Um, second update, I started high school three days ago. Today was my third day. I have to say, I'm liking it, um, I'm getting used to it, and I'm really excited for this school year. This is actually one of my school shirts, um, but yeah. Okay, so I think that's all the updates right now. Um, so my story time is the story, um, is the time I got bullied in first grade. Sorry about that. So... Um, I went to an all-black school, and I was one of the very few white people that went there. So, I, um, I did start out with a lot of friends. I really did. But this one girl got peanut butter and jealous, and she decided to take them all away. Like, make them turn against me or whatever, not talk to me. But I only had one friend that really, like, stuck by my side. Her name was Kristen Walker, and she had, dude, like, I remember, like, everything. She had this, oh, my God, her skin tone was, like, fine, like, oh, my gosh, beautiful. And, like, oh, it was, like, this, like, caramel, fla- not flavor, ew, this caramel kind of, like, color, so pretty. And she had curly, like, brown hair, but she was really pretty. Anyway, um... She, uh, okay, so we're going to call the, wait, I honestly feel like I've told this story. Like, I really honestly feel like I've told this story. You know what, We I will be right back. So, turns out I did tell this story. So, we're going to actually change the story time. And we can just go ahead and tell the story of how this happened. So, (laughs) I'll ask this already. Okay, so basically, I was at a party, and it was kind of like a sleepover. And so, it was me, Kai, Kaden, Mackenzie, Gavin, and Gavin brought his friend Dylan. So, you're like all. And, well, and there was, like, Audrey and, uh, Bryson and Evan and Avery. Like, yeah, that's how many kids there were. But, like, we didn't hang out with all of them. Our squad, I guess you could say, was Mackenzie, me, Kai, Dylan, Gavin, and sometimes Audrey. But the Gavin and Dylan are 11, so they're around Kai's age. Mackenzie's 12, so, uh, of course, I'm the oldest kid there. So, like, you know, there's a lot of adults and stuff. And so, I can't remember why, but I was going to the laundry room to get away from the boys. And, like, Mackenzie followed me, which I was fine with that. And Audrey, of course, was following Mackenzie. So, we go, I, I realized the boys were following us. So, I was like, uh-uh. So, like, we kind of made it into a game. And so, I, I we ran into the laundry room. The boys had a bat. Like, I don't know why. So, I went to shut the door, and they put the bat in between. And so, I was like, oh, God. So, like... I, uh, like, kept opening and shutting the door, like, (laughs) I don't know, I don't know why, but I did, 
And so I was like, okay, so nothing's happening. The bat's still between the door. So I was like, okay, I, I have an idea. So I decide to open the door and quickly push the bat out. And as I did that, somebody was leaning on the door. And so it shut on my hand. It like slammed on my hand because like we were using a lot of force. So it slammed on my hand and I pulled it out really fast because like um, my hand is in the way. So it's not going to shut all the way. So like it, it slammed. I went yeet and like I pulled it out. But like I was in so much pain. But like I kind of like it was hurting throughout the night and stuff. But it wasn't as bad. Um, so like I just like toughed it out and like I kept the door shut and stuff while I'm holding my hand and I'm like oh my god that like really hurts so like I'm holding the door shut like I am not letting Gavin I'm not letting any of the boys in and Kai is of course helping them try to get in and Kai's like Trin I'm like I need you I'm like no you don't no you don't like no like I'm I'm not stupid like I know so um like I said throughout the night it was hurting like um, like, you couldn't tell it was swollen, like, there wasn't, you couldn't see anything, so I was, like, I was telling Dylan and Gavin, I was, I was telling really, like, all squad, I was, like, yeah, um, it's probably just gonna be a bruise, you know, I'll probably be fine, and so, like, Dylan's, like, you should probably put some ice on that, I was, like, no, it's fine, like, I'll be fine, so the next morning, um, I could not move it, like, you know, like, I, it wasn't broken or anything. Like, like, see, like, it's getting better, but, like, um, I, uh, like, I couldn't get dressed on my own. Like, I couldn't, like, do my hair. Like, I couldn't even brush my hair. Like, I could not do anything with two hands. So, I had to do everything with one hand. And so, this is my good hand. Um, but I have to be careful with my thumb because... This is, I guess this is another update I forgot to say. Um, yeah, that's what it looks like. But it's okay. Um, but it does hurt sometimes, like, if I hit it on something. But it's doing better. It's my only good hand. Um, and, uh, what was I saying? I was, like, um, like, in pain. But, like, I was trying to get my mind off of it. Like, it wasn't, like excruciating pain it was just like I had to be really really careful with it because I couldn't move it and if this hand like barely touched over it like I'm not even kidding like if it like like gently brushed it would hurt really bad it it still actually does that um so I didn't have this on at the time because I was still at the sleepover so we go out to eat um after I get picked up from the sleepover and I'm telling my mom, like, I'm like, mom, this, like, really hurts. And before we went out to eat, uh, Bryson's grandpa came over. And I was telling him, and he's like, yeah, it looks swollen. So I didn't even realize my thumb was swollen. Like, it wasn't, like, purple swollen. It was, like, fatter than this one. And so it was like, wow, like, I guess it is. So my mom, okay, so I think that same night... She was like, I have this thing, like, it should help it and stuff. And so, I know it's just my thumb and, like, you see my hands and stuff. Like, I can move, ow, I can move these fingers. But my, since, like, my thumb is connected to this, um, my mom said that this will help it. And it actually has helped it. Like, it is getting better. But I still have to, ow, like, I just brushed over my thumb and that hurt. I still have to be really careful. So the first day of school, I wore this, and it was a pain in the butt because I couldn't do anything with two hands. I had to do everything with one hand. And so the second day, I took it off, and I kept it on my backpack. Um, and I just wanted to try the day out without it on. And I was, it was, it was okay. Um, and so today, I did the same thing. Um, and I realized that I have a bruise on my thumb. Like, it's becoming a bruise, and I still can't really, like, do anything. So, that's awesome, right? Um, so, and, like, I really want to do my hair. Like, I did not do my hair today because, like, I did my hair yesterday, which was a braid. It was a regular braid, but my thumb hurt after I did that. And this is a fishtail, which takes longer, so I just didn't do that. Um, so... 
I'm just trying it out. And when I got home, I put this on because it was starting to hurt a lot. And so every once in a while, it will like hurt like really bad. But it is getting better and it still hurts. And it's going to take some time. Like I thought it was going to take a few days for it to get better. But it's taking longer. Um, but yeah. <laughs> um, so that's what happened to my thumb. Yeah. So, I will be doing a backpack. What's in my backpack? I don't know when, but I will be doing a video on that because I got a really cute backpack. And, um, yeah, I'm just going to explain that on the What's in My Backpack challenge. I mean, not challenge, thing. Um, so, yeah, comment down below anything that you want me to do, really. Um, oh, yeah, and the pain is kind of spreading. Throughout my hand, forgot to say that. But yeah. Alright, so the question of the day today is What do you think happened to my hand? <laughs> um, because I don't know what I did to it, to be honest. All I know is I didn't break it, but I have no clue what I did to it. So if you would please answer that question, like honestly, please, like if you know me personally, like DM me or Snapchat me, like, honestly, please, because I really want to know, um, so, yeah, um, comment down below, the question of the day is, what do you think happened to my hand, what do you think I did to it, and, yeah, I will see you guys <laughs> later, bye!